talking about 5G networks. Uh, 5G networks are networks that are on the rise right now. Uh, it's not just a step up to 4G, it's more than that. I'll be explaining that in the video. Um, 5G networks uh, have been shown to be soon rolling out nationwide. Uh, ads have been displayed by Verizon and T-Mobile showing that this is soon going to be a thing. Uh, Samsung, Huawei, Oppo, and uh, Xiaomi have released or confirmed that they have 5G variants soon or already in stock. Um, if you haven't joined the uh, 5G hype train yet, I would highly recommend you do. The reason is, well there are many, but the main reason is these tech giants are doing this for a reason. They know that this is going to be the next big thing, no puns intended. Um, Samsung and Samsung, Huawei, Oppo and Xiaomi I think will be one of the few who will soon support 5G. I think it's going to go all big and um, this is a good time to join the hype train. So when you get the phone, soon get the phone and when these carriers start nationwide, going nationwide with this 5G, uh, it's a good time to make the network speeds up to 1.5 times faster and many other reasons as I'll explain furthermore in the video. Deployment of these uh, 5G networks will soon be happening across the US in the near future. Um, in Britain, actually, the uh, carrier named Vodafone, uh, a big carrier in Britain, actually is planning to release their 5G networks in late July. The British government, therefore, has asked Huawei to uh, set up their infrastructure in the country. Um, many uh, in industries in the U.S. and across the world that will be benefiting from these blazing fast connectivity connectivities is IoT, the Internet of Things, um, also self-driving cars, and then there is the drones, which are have been. It was a big thing two years ago. And now it's becoming a big thing again. And self-driving cars, it's not there 100%. Google was doing it a few years ago, and um, it's still on the rise, but you never know.